I'm here in Abu Dhabi and uh, already in 24 hours, uh, there's so much going on I want to tell you about it all. First of all, I went to like a mini OPEC meeting yesterday. It's called the JMMC. The Russians were there, the Saudis were there, uh, and along with the US, they are the three big oil producers on the world. Now, look, I, I went to a meeting in Algiers just like five or six weeks ago where they were talking about putting as much oil as they could on the table. Now, they're talking about taking a vast amount of oil off the table. What an extraordinary turnaround in six weeks. And the key X factor here is the sanctions over Iran that weren't because the waivers came in, eight big waivers. And that's big news, the fact that now the Saudis and their allies are potentially on December 6th at OPEC in Vienna are going to take a lot of oil off the table as well. Whether the Russians will take that oil off the table remains to be seen because Alexander Novak, to me, was pretty quiet on whether he would take oil off the table. Another bit of news for you I've been making here uh, out of Abu Dhabi and I spoke to Armin Nasser who's the CEO of Saudi Aramco and of course this is the IPO that wasn't. Is it delayed? Is it axed? Well according to Armin Nasser there is still going to be an IPO of Aramco which could be worth according to the Saudis two trillion dollars according to the rest of the world maybe as low as one trillion dollars but he says it will still happen they've done too much groundwork to let it go he says the time frame is still 2021 that to me sounds like the long grass but hey who am I to say back to you guys.